Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. This is Najwa Husseini with Azadi News. Bangladesh and Malaysia reject rescued Rohingya refugees. Two more Rohingyas die and five more infected with coronavirus in Cox's Bazaar. Bangladesh has said it will not take back nearly 300 Rohingya who were detained by Malaysia after their boat was found drifting off the country's northwestern island of Langkawi as hostility towards the mostly Muslim refugees continues to grow. Bangladesh's foreign minister A.K. Abdul Mu'min said his country was neither obligated nor in a position to take any more Rohingya and urged the global community to help relocate the more than 1 million Rohingya who fled there after a brutal crackdown in their native Burma in 2017. On Tuesday, Malaysia's defense minister Ismail Sabri Yaqub had suggested that the rescue refugees should be sent back to Bangladesh. The Rohingya should know if they come here they cannot stay, the minister told reporters in Kuala Lumpur. Sabri said Malaysia's foreign minister would ask Dhaka to take back the detained refugees if they were found to have fled the refugee camps, while the government would also ask the UN refugee agency UNHCR to resettle the group in a third country. As of February 2020, UNHCR had registered an estimated 180,000 refugees in Malaysia about half of whom were Rohingya. The agency is allowed to operate in the country by the government and register those it considers in need of protection. On Monday, the 269 Rohingya were arrested after their boat was found damaged. The body of a woman was also retrieved. According to Binar News, nine crew members fled after the boat entered Malaysian waters. It added that boat may have carried as many as 500 Rohingya when it departed Bangladesh, but only 269 were found including those who initially jumped overboard but were later rescued. Two more Rohingya men died from coronavirus on Monday, taking total death in the Rohingya camp to three. One of them was 58 years old and a resident of Camp 10, while another was 70 years and a resident of Camp 7 in Ukia, said Dr. Abu Toha, MRH Buyan, health coordinator of the Refugee Relief and Rehabilitation Commission. Besides, five more Rohingyas were diagnosed with coronavirus on Monday. He said, adding that total number coronavirus virus cases rose to 35 till Monday. Meanwhile, two Rohingya men made recovery from coronavirus. Earlier, a 71-year-old man died at isolation center of Rohingya camp on June 1st. Earlier, on May 16th, two more Rohingyas were diagnosed with coronavirus at Kutapalung Rohingya camp in Cox's Bazar, forcing the local administration to put some 5,000 Rohingyas at the camp under complete lockdown. This is today's news. To get more updates about Rohingya, subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the notification bell. Visit our website azadinews.org and follow our social media accounts. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.